Hey everyone, if you've ever played around with AI powered tools for animation, video, or design, you know how tricky it can be, like keeping characters consistent, making sure the backgrounds don't change randomly, and dealing with a bunch of different platforms. It's a lot, right? Um, well, today I'm bringing you the ultimate all-in-one platform for AI-generated videos, animations, and images. It brings together all the major AI tools you've heard of, like Runway, Kling, and Minimax, so you don't have to keep jumping between different subscriptions. Whether you're making a short film, a YouTube video, or even an ad, this platform helps you keep everything consistent and professional with way less effort. Today I'm going to walk you through how it works and why it's such a game changer. So stick around, and if you love AI content creation, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Now, let's dive right in. First click the link in the description to check it out. Basically, this platform brings together all the best AI tools for image, video, and animation generation into one place. No more switching between different apps or paying for separate subscriptions. Polo AI has everything in one spot. I've been testing it out for a while now, and today I'm going to walk you through how to create AI-generated animations using their consistent character video tool. We'll see how well it works, test some cool features, and figure out if it's really worth using. Let's jump in. Right now, we've got a bunch of options here. Image to video, text to video, AI animation, video effects, and more. Plus, there's an AI image generator, image to image tools, and a bunch of other creative features. Honestly, it's got pretty much everything you need to work with AI in one place. And that's what makes it so great. But for today, we're gonna focus on consistent character creation. So let's click over here and get started. Here you have the option to upload three different images. I've already created some, so let's upload them. Uh, first, I've got an image of a little girl, then a monster in Pixar style, and finally a beautiful hill covered in flowers. Now that all three images are uploaded, you'll also see an option to try a sample image, but since we've got ours ready, we'll just move forward. Now, this feature lets you maintain character consistency across different video generations. It even gives you a quick tutorial on how to do it. Upload your images, type a short prompt under 1500 characters, and hit create. Super simple. Um, all right, let's type our first prompt, okay? A little girl is playing with a monster on the hill. Now, we also get some AI-generated prompts to refine our scene. A little girl gleefully plays tag with a friendly monster on a grassy hill under a bright blue sky. The girl giggles as she and the colorful monster play hide and seek on the hill. As the sun sets, the girl and the monster share stories and laughter atop the hill, forming an unbreakable bond. I really like the first one, so I'll go ahead and copy it and confirm. Next, we choose the aspect ratio. I prefer 16 by 9 landscape but you also have portrait 9 by 16 and square 1 by 1. Then we select the duration. Uh, resolution wise, you can choose between 360 pixels, 720 and 1080. Under motion range, I'll keep it on auto, but you can tweak it to control movement for body parts and objects. Um, all right, now let's hit create and see what happens. Now the video is generating, it's taking a moment, but um, let's see how it turns out. Okay, here it is, the little girl and the monster are playing. It looks pretty good. The motion could be a bit smoother, but overall it does a great job of following the scene. Let's try another one. Uh, this time I'll tweak the prompt a bit. A little girl sits with her monster friend on the ground talking. Again, we get three AI generated prompts. A little girl sits on the ground with her monster friend sharing secrets and giggles under a rainbow colored sky. The girl and her monster friend play imaginary games, creating a world of magic and friendship around them. In a quiet park, the girl and her fluffy monster friend discuss their dreams, surrounded by blooming flowers and chirping birds. I really like the third one, so I'll copy and confirm. Keeping the same settings, let's hit create. 
And here it is. Wow, this one turned out so much better. Yes, the characters are clearly visible. And even though the AI slightly changed the background, it still looks amazing. You can see the birds flying around, but the monster is holding something in its hands. It looks like a teddy bear, but the shape isn't really clear. I really like the colors of the flowers and the trees in the background. Now, let's try something different. I'll create a video without AI assistance. Uh, I'll enter my prompt. A little girl sits in the grass chatting with her friendly monster. Um, this is just for testing, so I'll, I'll keep it at four seconds to save credits. Let's hit create. Okay, here it is. Um, it picked up the flowers from my original image, but the characters aren't actually sitting. It's still a cool result, but I think using the AI-generated prompts gives better accuracy. Let's refine the prompt even more. This time, I used ChatGPT to enhance it. A little girl sits cross-legged in the grass, holding an open book as she reads aloud to her friendly monster. The monster, large but gentle, leans in closely, listening with wide, curious eyes. Sunlight flutters through the trees, casting a warm glow over the peaceful meadow as they share the story together. Uh, let's see what happens. Wow, uh, this one is perfect. The AI nailed it, the little girl and the monster are both sitting down, the book is there, the sunlight adds a beautiful touch, and the whole scene looks cinematic. Definitely downloading this one. Alright, let's try another creative scenario. I'll tweak the scene to, a little girl stands on her toes, reaching for a ripe orange from a tree. Her friendly monster stretches out a large, furry hand to help her. Sunlight filters through the leaves, casting a golden glow as they work together to pick the perfect orange. Keeping the same settings, let's hit create. And here it is. This turned out amazing. You can really see the determination on the little girl's face, the monster helping her, and the warm sunlight coming through the trees. Uh, this is next level AI storytelling. Um, now let's experiment with something cinematic. I'm going to delete these three images in the previous prompt. Then I'll upload three new images I generated earlier. A Viking warrior. A pirate captain. and an inviting tavern. I'll create a viking and pirate scene in a rustic tavern. A viking and a pirate sit at a wooden tavern table, clinking mugs of ale, sharing battle stories as laughter fills the room. Let's generate it and see what we get. Okay, here it is. They're having a great time. The viking is raising his beer for a toast and the lights in the background give the whole scene a warm and inviting vibe. This looks like something straight out of a movie. For our final test, I'll create an epic viking warrior scene with a dragon companion. Let's upload our three images. First, the image of a beautiful female viking warrior. Second, our mighty dragon. And third, the image of a valley with lush green fields. I'll refine the prompt to ensure a fierce female viking stands beside her massive dragon, gently resting her hand on its scales. The dragon's eyes glow softly as the two share a moment of trust under the golden sunset in a vast open field. This one is important because I want the AI to show the interaction between the viking and the dragon. Let's see if it works! And we got it. The viking is touching the dragon, the setting is perfect, however the AI didn't quite capture the valley, it changed the location a bit. Let's tweak the prompt a little to get a better result. I've tweaked the prompt a bit in ChatGPT to make sure the valley shows up in the clip this time. Along with the action of her touching the dragon, let's paste the prompt and see the result. I'll keep the same aspect ratio, same resolution, same motion range, and hit create. And this one turned out even better. We've got the valley in the background, and the Viking warrior woman is gently touching the dragon. It's an awesome result. The AI nailed it. It is a great outcome.
Apollo AI is a game changer for creating stunning AI generated videos with consistent characters and cinematic quality. If you're looking to take your AI video creations to the next level, this tool is definitely worth checking out. All right, that's it for today. I hope you found this breakdown of Apollo AI helpful and that it gives you a new way to create high quality, consistent videos with AI. If you like the tool I brought you today, you can access it by clicking the link in the description. It's an absolute game changer for anyone working with AI generated content, whether you're making animations, short films, or social media videos. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more AI and creative content, and hit that bell icon so you never miss an update. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Drop a comment below and let me know what you think or if there's anything else you'd like me to cover. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.